Dynamic Disk Designs introduces a multi-level cervical C1 through C7 dynamic model. This model has been constructed with identical bony properties with the recreation of the soft tissues. A hypermobile elastomeric disc has been constructed at the C5, C6 level with C6-7 demonstrating a central herniation under load. Now encroachment syndromes can be demonstrated through the spinal canal with the nucleus pulposus pushing posteriorly into the spinal canal area. Additional features include a cruciform ligament at C1-2 demonstrating approximation of the facets on the right the facet has been painted red to demonstrate inflammation as well as other facets to show inflammation with decreased joint space width. Other inflamed facet joints are at the level of the hypermobile C56 disc as well as one adjacent at the C45 level on the left. As discs degenerate Early in their cascade, disc height loss will contribute to increased mobilization, leading to facet approximation and hyaline cartilage wearing. Rotation will demonstrate how the facet will gap open on the ipsilateral side. Good joint space width is demonstrated at the C2 through C4 levels, while the hypermobile segment shows approximation and facet joint width narrowing. Dynamic Disc Designs proudly constructs accurate anatomical models to help the patient-doctor team improve outcomes through better patient education. If patients understand their pain generators, they will do more to help the doctor improve the outcomes along with treatment. Whether it means changing postural components or avoiding exercises that may exacerbate an already inflamed tissue. Visit Dynamic Disc Designs to find out more.